Hi guys, today I will be showing you some live swatches of the brand new UK based nail polish brand called Minx London. Minx is a couture boutique nail polish brand and it launched on the 31st of August. Minx currently has 12 nail polishes, although they are already working on new colours. In this video I will be showing you the top row of nail polishes. These are all the lighter shades, the pastel shades. This is part 2, I will link part 1 down below. First up is the shade Bella Bose and this is a very sheer, light, milky, French manicure type of colour. It is very sheer on the first coat and that is obviously the point of this nail polish. I love the way it looks on just one coat. It has a very even finish and there are no streaks and it makes my nails look very clean. The second coat brightens up that color. Again, it is still very sheer, more sheer than my camera is actually showing. The formula is very easy to work with and it dries to a super glossy finish. I don't think this colour can be built up to be fully opaque in any amount of coats so I will be adding three coats for this swatch but the swatch photo has four coats. Next up is Cream Puff and this is a, another sheer polish, this is a lot more yellow toned and it also has subtle golden shimmer. This is just as sheer as the other polish so I don't think it can be built up to full opacity either. The formula is very easy to work with, it's very smooth and not streaky whatsoever. You can definitely see that golden shimmer, it doesn't get lost in the polish. It builds up really nicely in two coats. It dries to that same glossy finish as Bella Bose, so there's no need to apply a top coat. Again, I'm doing three coats for the live swatches and the swatch photo has four coats. Next up is Kiss Me Softly and this is a very pale pink cream polish. This has a great formula. It is quite opaque on the first coat but there are still quite a few streaks so I will need to apply a second coat. The formula is very easy to work with, it's not too thick or too thin. The second coat completely covers up any streaks and it is fully opaque on just two coats. Again, it dries with a beautiful glossy finish so there's no need to apply top coat. Next up is Peach Cream and this is a peach cream. It also has some very subtle silver shimmer in there. You can slightly see it in the bottle but on the nail it is very difficult to see unless you're really looking for it. The formula is okay, it's very sheer on the first coat and on the streaky side. It dries to that same amazing glossy finish, so there's no need to apply a top coat. This builds up really beautifully. It is almost fully opaque in two coats, which was unexpected. I do have some very, very slight streaks. If you're in a rush, you could probably get away with just doing two coats, but I will be adding a third coat for the swatch. The third coat definitely covers up any of the streaks. Next up is Sweet Lips and this is a pinky coral with tons of silver shimmer. This will actually show up on your nails very visibly. 
The formula on this is amazing. It's very easy to work with and it is pretty opaque on the first coat. I will need a second coat because you can't see a visible nail line. This is slightly thicker than the previous polish, so for me it is much easier to work with. It is fully opaque in two coats. I would recommend adding a top coat. The last colour I have to show you is Live and Lust and this is a lilac purple cream polish. This has an amazing formula and I wish every single formula was like this. It is so easy to apply, it's so smooth, it is almost opaque in one coat but you definitely do need to apply a second one just to cover anything up. It dries with a beautiful glossy finish. The second coat really brightens up the colour and it is fully opaque in two coats. So that is part two of my Minx London Live swatches. I really enjoy all 12 of these colours. I think my favourites would have to be in part 1, but my favourites from part 2 are that soft pastel light baby pink and of course the last purple polish Live and Lust. I hope you enjoyed this video and I will see you in the next one.